New boo goofin. The only thing that's hurting is my hips. I mean, look at the material. They look like, they give like fly knit. They give like... They're so pretty, guys. That was the best one yet. I never want to like not wear these. Okay, my new running shoes just came in. I did a unboxing for Tiki Taki, but I wanted to show you guys. Um, I literally ordered them last night on Amazon because I like to get things fast. If I'm not gonna get it overnight, then I'm gonna go to the store and I'm gonna find it, even if I gotta pay more because I need it right now, max. These are the New Balance 1080, what are they? <laughs> they're these, okay. So we're gonna test them out. I think they were like 160, 170. I just wanna put them on right now just to see. But I mean, look at the material. They look like, they give like fly knit. They give like Nike Lunar, but more cushion. Do you guys remember Nike Lunars? I used to love, did you guys even see the shoe? I used to love Nike Lunars. Those were my favorite shoes ever. I actually had, um, I went through a few pairs of them, but they were like, those were literally the best shoes ever, 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 ever. I'm pretty sure someone stole them from me in college, but I loved them. Okay, wow. Okay, wow. They're super light, true to size. I got a seven and a half. You can get them wide or narrow, which is cool too. Now I won't lie, I kind of do be looking a little bit like a grandpa, grandma, but at the end of the day, this is about cushion and about saving the joints, shoddy. So we don't need to be worried about looking like grandma or grandpa because we just got to make sure we can make it to be in a grandma or grandpa. <laughs> These shoelaces are interesting. They're like stretchy. Okay. Mm hmm. Fit is, I think, good. Oh, well, I need to shave my legs. Don't look at them. I realized I missed a really big patch of hair on my legs. So I'm not really sure how that happened, but you know what happens. I'm supposed to strength train today instead of run, but I might do both. I don't know if that's optimal, but I just want to run in my new shoe. Whoa. Okay, wow, let me put you guys on the ground. <laughs> if my floor is dirty, just shut up. Whoa, these are so comfy, bro. Like, again, don't look at my leg hairs if I have them, but these are squishy. I feel like I could... <laughs> these are nice, bro. Whoa, these are so comfortable, bro. All the cats are looking at me like, what is mom doing? I really like these. <sighs> okay, well, we're gonna wear them around. I'm gonna break them in just by wearing them around some. Oh my God, I'm out of breath. Our endurance is not there to be doing jumping like that. Let me get some water. Code Kalo. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, these are really comfy though. I think I'm gonna take you guys through. I probably just wear them to work out just to break them in a little bit. Like get them like, when you have running shoes, do you only run in them? Or can you like, buddy? No free buttholes. Or can you just, can you just like wear them as like dailies too? Like, do I need to break these in? Like, should I walk around in them? You know, I might just wear them to the gym just to like get a little comfy in them. I definitely need to tighten these if I'm running. Yeah, these are seven and a half. You could get wide, you could get narrow, but these are just straight up seven and a half. They fit me good, true to size for sure. Sir, your tail is always out of control. Always knocking things over. Do you hear me? He follows me everywhere, bro. Like it's so cute, but sometimes I'm like, buddy. Like I'll put this picture on the screen of him last night. It was so cute. He was like fully laid in my lap. I was so uncomfortable. My neck was literally hurting from the way I was laying on the couch, but I just stayed like that because once your cat gets comfortable, like you're stuck until they're not, you know what I mean? I tried a new coffee spot this morning called Mojo's. It's all right. I'm gonna go back and give it another try, but like she said to get this like caramel cookie thing. I don't know, loaded with calories, not the point. But I also was thinking this morning, guys, please stop fighting. Cats are fighting in the back room. I was thinking this morning, I was like, when did I decide to just not drink sugar-free coffees anymore? And I just decided to drink only full calorie coffees like when did that happen because all of a sudden like i'm so it's so acceptable to be drinking full calorie coffees for me i don't know when it happened but truly like i'm not mad about it i think that coffee brings me a lot of joy and i'm not in bodybuilding like i'm not in prep or anything so if i just like have that in the morning and i enjoy that then that's fine with me you know not my not me like finding a reason to explain to you why i can have it <laughs> <laughs> That's like, like eating disorder in me, but okay. I need to go edit this previous YouTube video for you guys. To hmm, let's get into it. I have no clue if you heard anything I said that whole time. So let's, cause the mic was off. Sick, well basically I just got a shipment of more hydration. <laughs> And I was saying that I, hydration and energy behind you guys, and I haven't loaded it in the fridge because I wanted to get a mini fridge and then stock the mini fridge and do a video because those always hit on TikTok. I just need to start putting some stuff in the fridge, you know? I've just been putting a few at a time or I just need to buy the mini fridge. I don't know, but I'm gonna full, throw a few of these in the fridge because she's a runner, she's a track star, you know? She needs to stay hydrated, okay? Period. Run it back, run it, run it back to I have no clue if you guys can see me. You're on top of my 
car, but like my trunk's up, I don't know, but we're about to run, second 10 minutes. We were gonna go train today, but I had to get this YouTube video out and then Dan needed to go play tennis, so my, and the gym closes at nine, so it just didn't make sense getting caught in traffic and all of that and wasting time. So I'm actually gonna go training tomorrow. I'm gonna share that with you guys too, but we're gonna do our uh, phase two run, phase two, second run. I don't know how you wanna, what you wanna call that, but we're gonna go into our second run. Another just 10 minutes. This time though, we're at a really big and pretty park. I don't even know if I'm even near a run trail, to be honest. Like, I don't know where those run trails are. I feel like they're not where I'm at because I'm by the parks. So if anything, I'm probably gonna run in this parking lot or, you know, I'm not really sure. We're gonna figure that out. So maybe we're gonna walk and then we're gonna find something. We're gonna figure it out either way. Feeling good, ready for run two. Got my new shoes on, new boot goofing, new run goofing. And um, yeah, let's get it going. This shadow is so awesome. <laughs> The only thing that's hurting is my hips. So I need to figure out how to stretch my hips because I'm like five minutes in. My hips are getting tight. My fucking headphones not working. That's why I ordered new ones, but it just keeps doing this like static thing and I'm almost through it. So it's in my pants right now. Someone's flying a drone, bro. All right, let me focus on this run and listen to some mic. Because new mic album's out and new Chris Brown album. Shut up. Run number two. Dunzo. Definitely felt harder than the first one. I think I kept checking my phone too much too and like I'm like trying to record stuff and then there's a new mic album out. It's kind of a lot, but in general, good. Hips just hurt and my new headphones will be in tomorrow. Sunglasses will be in tomorrow. So that will be nice as I start to run way more and in the sun. I'll have to do it like early morning or later at night so it's not too hot, but yeah, overall really good. Can't complain. Just different in incline. Like going in a park is just so many different terrains. So but it was really pretty and nice, so we'll get used to it. But now on to training. See you in the gym. Okay, thoughts on the shoes because I forgot to tell you guys about that, and then we'll go to the lift tomorrow. But um, they're super, super cushiony, like very cushiony. There is a lot of room up here. Maybe I should have got the narrow ones. I didn't think I had narrow feet, but we're gonna keep testing them out and go with it. But they felt really good. The only thing that was tight is my hips, and I think that's just because I ran. So of course they're gonna be tight, but overall love love so far so we'll see okay thanks <laughs> that's all i needed hello oh my god you guys are pointing down so low <clears throat> So I was supposed to go train today and that was the plan until like 20 minutes ago. There's just a lot of stuff I need to get done, like business stuff, like finalized. You guys know it's April, right? April 15th on Monday. So just finalizing what stuff. So I just need, my attention needs to be in the office. So I'm not gonna go lift uh, right now. I'm probably just gonna go run instead. Lift late, I mean, I could lift later. I don't know, I just wanna run. So I think I'm just gonna go run for my, do my 10 minutes, get my three run days out of, out of it. And then the next two days I'll do strength training sessions, Saturday and Sunday, but look what just came in my new headphones and my new sunglasses my sunglasses may be at the door too i'm gonna go check they're so pretty guys like stupid pretty like look at these look at that i paid a little bit extra for these ones but i just like how pretty they are i don't know I like them. and i already put them in my ear and they're so good like they do not move compared to the airpod pros i like airpod pros for like work calls and stuff but running like no and the one in the ear is like broken, like I said previously. Yeah, maybe you won't even see training in this video, honestly. Maybe the training will be like its own video, like just the two days of training. I think that's what I'm gonna do. That way this will just be my three days of running. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I just decided that right now. But yeah, these are so beautiful. Um, I'll have them linked down below if you're interested in them. They're the same as the normal Fit Pros. It's just a collaboration with Aloe and they just look pretty. So that's why I got them because they looked pretty and they're different and not everyone's gonna have them. I don't like being the same as everyone else. You guys know that. Or maybe you don't, you just learned that. But it came in this beautiful box and I immediately dropped them out of the box just like a typical Apple buyer would do. So rolled clip. Look at how shiny these are and how... I literally can't stand myself. Yeah, lovely. Love that for me. But okay, I'm gonna go change now that I'm running because I'm wearing more of like a lifting outfit. But this is the breeze jacket that I have on right now from Young LA. This actually really slept on, I feel like. This whole collection that dropped was pretty slept on, but this is like one of my favorite things. It's a size medium. You can definitely get away with the small, but you can cinch in the sides. You could do it like where it's not. Like I love this. It's so thin. Like it's called the breeze hoodie. Like it's literally perfect for springtime. Pelican shoddies on performance. 
I don't even know. I think this is from like the love sets. I've been wearing these a lot because I like the length of them. Let's go hit our third run of the week and wrap up all of our runs, bro. That's crazy. I'm excited. We're fitted. I just threw on a young LAT. I had to put a high impact sports bra on because the one I had on was more of like a like chiller. Like I only have one really high impact one and it's from Young LA. I need to get more of them, but ghost hat, some Young LA. I forgot what these are. I compare them to my Lulu ones, which I really, really love. Just obviously way cheaper. The New Balance, they're so, so comfy. My hips are super tight. So I'm going to just kind of like hypervolt um, in that area. And then I guess do like a little bit of a dynamic warm up, and then just go for a 10 minute run. Let me get my hopper bolt a little hypervolty. We actually have a few hypervolts. We have like a mini one. You guys can see hypervolt go. And then we have this one that young LA for her gifted me for Christmas. This one. Why is it so dark? That's the mini one that I actually bought. It was like 160, I think maybe. I don't know. Therabody, which this one's way louder than this one. This one's just easier to hold and travel with. It's cute though. Just a little cutie schlooty. It's not that loud, but right there. That's where it hurts, bro. Oh my god, that's crazy clip. <laughs> this fits mad comfy. I just threw this together, bro. I just be doing things, bro. I just feel just good at this, you know? <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, let's just get these glutey booties warmed up and I'll see you outside. I'm excited to put my headphones on. My sunglasses aren't here. I just checked. Sad face, but I have a hat. I have a different pair. Let's see. Let me go get them. These are definitely more for style, like fake Balenci ones. But like, they could work. <laughs> What up, bro? What up, bro? What up, bro? They actually could work. They definitely don't move. They're not that comfy, but they could work. We'll wait until the cool ones come in. I can't wait to show you them. They're pretty freaking sick. I got them on Amazon for like super cheap. I'll see you on the run, baby. All right, just did a little bit of just like some movement. My hips are seriously so tight, so I really need to stretch after, but let's go get this 10 minutes done. I'm gonna, maybe I'll try and take a bath tonight or something. I'm not sure. I think we have friends coming over. I don't know what time, so there's just a lot on my mind. Like I'm just in this mood today where I'm very like, there's so much to do that I just don't, like I don't know what to do, you know? I barely slept last night, like barely at all. I didn't even leave the couch until two in the morning. It was just no bueno. So let's go get this run. Let's focus on the run one thing at a time. Just a reminder, you gotta focus on one thing at a time. That's all you can do and prioritize what needs to be done right now versus things that probably don't need to be done right now, but we love to focus on, you know what I mean? I do that too, so all right, let's do it. the best one yet like I feel really good like genuinely really really good like besides my hips being tight I wasn't like coughing and puffing my heart rate wasn't sitting like at nearly as high as kind of paying attention to it I know I just got the whoop or didn't just get it but I just charged it and had it on the past two runs like way 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 easier than before so I'm not mad about that that's crazy like it feels like a drastic difference from yesterday and I've ran what three days in a row now I think so yeah Wow, and very excited because now going to next week, we're doing 15 minutes three times a week. And I know like I already am eager to like push more. Like I want to kind of like, almost like I already start running 20 minutes, but I want to do this slow and steady. I don't want to destroy myself. I'm gonna actually build up properly. And by this third run of this week, I already feel a difference. So if I just keep at this pace, I think I'll actually be building the endurance properly and giving my body time. Next week will be better too, spreading out my runs a little bit and strength training. Very happy with that. Headphone wise, they're pretty good. You could definitely hear the wind, which that bothers me. But when you have them in noise cancellation mode, they're really not that bad. Like I wouldn't say they're as good as an AirPod Max cancellation, but they do not move. Like these things never moved in my ear once. Like it feels so natural. Like I didn't even realize it's in my ear. For that reason, these trump the AirPod Pros when it comes to like working out. So if you needed that review, now you have it. Like I said, I'll link these down below for you guys. If you're interested in sagging them, now I need to go sit on my computer for the next two hours, crank out some work before I have a call at four to go over all the shit I need to figure out. So, so yeah. Oh, I'm just gonna, ow. Oh, my hips, bro. My sunglasses came in, so I figured I'd just open them out here with Bubba, Shelby and Shaudi and Sean Daly. Okay, so I ordered these off Amazon. Cause like, let's be real. Did you see that butterfly, bro? Try to 
come at me, bro. I'm a, I'm a fat, I'm a runner now, bro. Don't fuck me. I was looking at running sunglasses. They're all so expensive, dude. Like maybe one day I'll get there, but I already spent a lot on the like headphones and shoes. I was like, chill, chill. You ran 10 minutes, bitch, chill. You know what I mean? I got these for like, I'm pretty sure that I want to say they were like, there's a receipt in here. Pretty sure they were like 20 something dollars. It's so funny, my neighbors just like, they're almost like embarrassed to look at me. And I feel like they think that like, cause I'm dressed like a boy so much. I feel like they think like that, like me and Dan are like little kids that our parents just have money. Or they're like, what do these kids do? But in reality, we're like not kids, you know? <laughs> I need to delete some stuff off the memory card because I just saw there's like four minutes left, one second. Okay, we're good now. But um, basically I wanted, um, I swear, like I don't remember ever having ADHD, but I feel like I do all of a sudden also. Why is that in my pocket? Uh, sunglasses. Don't get me wrong, like all these things I'm buying like are not necessary. I just am someone who, once I like get into something, I like have to have everything. It's kind of a stupid right? But it is what it is, you know? It's just who I am at this point. So, so I was like, I'm gonna need running sunglasses because runners have running sunglasses. <laughs> so dumb. So I went on to Amazon. Actually, I went on to Google first. I looked up like running sunglasses and um, a bunch of stupid expensive ones came up like Oakley's, this and that, doing wrong. I love Oakley's, I have a bunch of pair of Oakley's. Like I just am not spending over $200 on a pair of sunglasses right now. Like maybe in the future, like I said, like let me let me get some run sponsors, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like Shadi's only run 30 minutes in her total career. Like let's relax. But I saw these ones, they're called X Tiger. Oh, I can hook it onto my bag. And it come, they came, it looked like it came with like three different, okay, these are gonna be dope. Okay, okay. Oh my God, okay, there's so much in here already guys. What is this? Wear glasses to see this beautiful pattern. One sec, dog. One sec. I haven't even gotten glasses out. Okay. What's that? Okay. There's a lot going on here. There's so many different things. There's like three different lenses. Okay. Bitch, are these even running sunglasses? I don't know. I just looked up running sunglasses and these looked like they were it. Like, I don't always want to be running with a hat on. I'm not like, you know. Wait, these are sick, bro. Shut your pie hole. Shut up, X Tiger. Okay, okay, X Tiger. <laughs> I won't lie, like these feel cheap as fuck. If they get the job done. Ow, it was ripping out my hair, bro. Whoa, this makes the world look way cooler. <gasps> I would run on these all day. I really, whoa, I never wanna like not wear these. The world looks so cool and I know I probably look cool. Let me take a selfie. Hold on, let me take a selfie. <laughs> I'll put this selfie on the screen. Oh my God. Shadi is so f cool, not the running. Wait, these are actually so sick. I guess I'll link these down below. I really like the way this looks. Let me look at that thing it said. It said to look at this with the glasses on. I don't see a beautiful pattern. I mean, okay. Um, we have a holder thing. We got like a strap if you want to put a strap on the back so that they you don't lose them. Like these aren't these aren't moving though. And then we have like I think these are extenders or different lengths for this for the back of this. This can clip in and then you could legit put your like uh, like if you're near sided far sided you could put that in there. I'm I'm good though. Like I got 2020 baby. I got 2020. Okay, we got three. I think it's two or three different lenses. Bitch, there's four. Okay, talk about value, baby. We got some just polarized UV blocking ones. I don't know, what do we have? These ones are just clear. Oh, I could use these for pickleball. Just clear would be sick for pickleball. Or if I just want to look cool, either way, really. Then we got these yellow ones. These are just for yellow vibes. Okay, kind of cool. Look, gives me fishing vibes. Ooh, I really like, like, like these too. These are more of like a tinted, but like sunglass. Oh, these are way darker. Yeah, they are not really. I like these best and they make me look cool. But if I wanna be a little bit more subtle, like I can, you know? Like that's always good to know. But the clear ones are cool for a pickleball too. These are actually pretty comfortable. I wasn't sure, you know? Don't get me wrong, like I said, they feel pretty cheap, but if they do the job, they do the job. And like the world looks so much better. Like why wouldn't they just put this filter naturally on the world, you know? Beats me. But yeah, I think this was the best money I've spent yet. Also, let me know how you guys are liking the style of the video. If you're literally just, it's almost like a podcast, but like, 
not because you guys are just hanging out with me and I'm literally just talking and talking and talking. Let me know what you guys are thinking about it. I mean, it looks like you guys have been loving it, um, but just let me know because it's definitely a different style than before. But uh, this is kind of like my old, old videos used to be like this. I feel like I would just always just sit down and talk about like everything. So, oh, that's fine. I pay a lot for internet. It doesn't work. That's fine. It doesn't worry. No matters. We have the fast internet. It doesn't work. Oh, no worries. Like what is happening? Get off the internet, bro. Let's see. I bet you guys are so warm right now because you're in the sun. Bitch, literally $24. Okay, I'm adding these to my running list right now for you guys. I put them in there. Yeah, if you guys go to my storefront, you'll be able to see this, but I'll link it down below, like I said. Running. Okay, three items, yeah. My shoes, sunglasses, and headphones. These are actually pretty fire. These are Fitfire Flames, shuddy. Okay, cool. Well, cool. Well, that's... Let's just like not, let's really not. It's been a bit of a morning. We think Dan has a flat tire because they got a tire in it, a tire in the tire. No, bitch, a nail in it. So he's cranky this morning and I felt really bad because I've been there. You guys know I've been there through my fair share of tires. Oof, one after another after another. And the bitches are so expensive. Like my tires alone are 400 a piece, not including tax and everything. I bet you his are probably the same. If you guys are wondering how these taste, my favorite, lemon lime and then orange and then kiwi strawberry and then strawberry uh, and then sour patch. But truly the best one is gonna be the lemon lime. Like I could just bathe in that one, truly. This one tastes like orange juice, straight up orange juice. 15 calories, four carb. That's a hydrate baby. They should be everywhere, but. Well, they were just touring the neighborhood. Now they know their neighbor's a freak and it's me. Oh my god, oh my god. The world literally sucks without these on. Thanks for hanging out for me with me today. Next vlog will be um, the training sessions, strength training sessions, and going over that, what my plan is with it. And I need to go sit in my office and get a bunch of, print a bunch of shit out, organize a bunch of stuff, and get ready for this big call that I have in an hour and a half. Need to be prepared. So things that business owners have to do that they don't tell you about, you know? <laughs> That's what I have to say about that. All right, I love you guys so much. As always, remember, control controllable and believe in yourself is a half damn battle. Peace. I really nailed that, this video, because last video was trash. <laughs> All right, see you in the next one.